feel like that's my responsibility, like my duty now. To try to live life like you did. So, thank you, Tom. Here is the beginning of a series that I've been sort of wanting to start for a pretty long time. We all know what Netflix is and we all know how many movies are on there. There are practically hundreds of thousands of, I don't even know how many movies are on there, but there are a lot of movies on Netflix. And when you have enough time to watch movies, if you're a regular person, unlike me, who watches 600 movies per year, you want to make sure that you are spending your time and your subscription to Netflix on a good film. So, Bridegroom will be the first of many Netflix reviews that I will be doing. They are the movies that have been going viral on Netflix that people just aren't sure if they'll be interested to. So these reviews will be very brief, at least under two minutes, that probably won't happen, because I don't want to waste your time. Sit back, relax, and decide if you want to watch this movie or not. Bridegroom doesn't have a director, but it does have a very talented writer, and it is a documentary about the tragic death of Tom Bridegroom. This documentary takes place around Shane Bitney Crone, I'm pretty sure that's how you say it, and his tragic story of how his boyfriend died by falling off of a roof 40 stories to his death. And this story is just completely heartbreaking, and I'm not going to say anything more than what the synopsis on Netflix says, but this movie is absolutely amazing. It takes an insane tragedy and brings it into something beautiful and a really great message. Bridegroom, I've seen it twice and I've cried for at least an hour after, after each viewing. Be prepared to cry. If you don't want to cry during a movie, do not watch this because this is easily the saddest movie I've ever seen in my entire life. Yes, it's sadder than Titanic, Me and Our Only Dying Girl, and even Pacific Rim. I cried during that one. But Bridegroom is that film that just makes you angry at the world and angry at some of the people's beliefs and I just don't understand how people can be so cruel and I don't understand how something this tragic can happen. If you like movies that stick with you a matter of months after viewing, Bridegroom is that movie. Having obviously great character development because it's based on the true story of what actually happened, it is just such a well-crafted documentary that was even it's it's even on YouTube that you can watch for free they didn't care about the money received of the people watching this film they care about getting the story out and getting what happened out and this was a GoFundMe film and 6,800 people somewhat donated and that is such a great thing and it just makes the movie all the better and all the more tragic that this actually did happen Bridegroom is one of the best movies I've ever seen in my entire life. It shows something so tragic brought up to its just most happy state. And it's even sad during that. And Shane Bitney Crow obviously makes something tragic in his YouTube video, but this documentary itself is 10 times better. It is beyond tragic. It is beyond beautiful. And if you have not seen it and you are contemplating seeing it, please do yourself a favor and see it. And I'm open to that.